Okay, uh, just did a quick initial test on the drill and it actually went in there really easy. I uh, got this uh, gas power generator, seems to be holding its own. That line on there will be attached to the top and expel any wastewater or cuttings. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start this thing up and show you. It's going to be a little loud so you won't be able to hear much. But I will at least show you it's spinning and what it can do to the ground. So whenever I get the time and I uh, drill this down uh, 100 feet or so, we'll see what happens. Okay, I got it started. I'm going to crank this thing on. A little difficult with one hand, so hang in there. Thing goes. Okay. okay, it was a little tough to hold on to uh, <laughs> with holding the uh, phone as well, but it is definitely making a dent in the earth there. It is definitely a slow process no problem put a chair up there just slowly but surely go down and i'm sure once i add water and it blows out those holes and gets rid of all the excess it'll just go that much better but hey initially it works and uh, this is good so i'm gonna keep going on once i start drilling down deeper i'll get updates and uh add to this video and go from there Okay, uh, part two, this is my uh, catch basin I dug. Uh, it's attached to the hose, goes through, any solids drop down, and it's filtered out here so you get water where I'm drilling. And uh, so far so good. Uh, I'm getting ready to uh, probably sit on the chair and just kind of drill down and see how well it works. Okay, uh, it is uh, cruising along, however, it is quite uh, eh, temperamental. Uh, Nathaniel did mention it might take a little bit of tweaking. However, I'm going to try something else. I started thinking about this and I want to see if I can get an impact sort of a wrench or impact driver. Something that gets some serious torque down there. Um, that way, I can really just power on and you know it might still take a while but it will at least um, you know do a little better job than this what we got in there it's okay it's slow going and stops frequently so I gotta either adjust it or something so I thought you know what let me just redesign it and do a impact version and just plow down through there without uh, worry uh anyways uh not bad it's it's actually a good learning experience and uh so far so good and i'll know exactly what i need to do from this point on might take a little longer unfortunately but eh, it works and uh, i would love to put a geothermal heating and cooling system down there and go down about 100 feet and drill several of those uh actually have a regular water well to boot uh it's got a lot of nice potential. 